This is Brook Drum with PrinterBot, and I'm showing you the laser cut Y bar ends. So we've got a package we had packed up with the Y bar ends. They were all attached together. I've snapped them apart and sandwiched them together in their pairs, and I've got some examples of what they should look like. First, I'm going to show you what they replace. So this is a Y bar end. This is the Y axis, and these are the bar ends. And they all look exactly like this, unless they were printed, and they'll look like that, but be a different color. But uh, we've printed them. This is, happens to be a uh, cast molding. They all look like that, except for this one over here that hits the micro switch, or we call it the end stop for the Y. So the Y end stop, this is a plus, by the way, very similar on an LC. So this one has a hole in it with, uh, I think this is a one inch, this might be an inch and a quarter here, but um, the ones that we provide in the new pack are one inch screws, it's 632 screws. And the, uh, this, this one on the left is the special one. Now you might have gotten four that look like this, you'd only use one of the holes for, this, for the end stop. But at any rate, these are the Y bar ends that they replace. We laser cut them now, and they look like this. Now, this one is the one that will replace uh, the one-inch screw that I was talking about. This will replace and be used as the one that goes here, okay? Because it has the bottom hole with a one-inch and a nylock. That nylock gives it a little bigger target to hit the switch. So we'll go like that. Now, we've when you sandwich these together, it makes a hole, you can see that, and it is a square hole, so when you put the screw in, you could drill that out or you could just screw down into it. It's going to grab. It doesn't just slide right in. It's going to grab the sides and it's going to tighten, but we do end up putting uh, a small hex screw at the bottom um, to do that. So I'm going to replace one of these, uh, but I wanted you to see this is how they are oriented at the front. And I, I've got that to show how it goes together. It'll go through the wood, that long one and a half inch screw, and then we'll use that at the bottom. And at the back, um, they're like this. Toes, I like to say the boot toe is always to the outside. So that's how they go. They come in the pack like this, joined together with four of those, like that. So instead of putting them all on, I'm going to put one on. So I've already got this together and I've already got the one inch screw through and the, the nylock done. So really all I need to do is remove the old one and put on the new one. So that's what I'm going to do. I like to cheat with the screw gun. I use one with a clutch. Now these, these old ones, they actually, um, I think this, this uh, 632 screw is a little shorter, so you can't just interchange these. See that's uh, one length and now we ship with a little longer length. So just put these aside. This is going to come right out. Now you can continue using these by the way if you'd like, but in this case, so I can put this through first, Let's see how that does. The heated bed uh, screw here is in the way, which we're going to correct here in a second. But for now, I'll just get that out of the way. So, this, is, this doesn't push down automatically. I'm going to have to screw it down. By the way, 
when this goes through the wood, if you send it through that fast with the screw gun, boy, does that sucker get hot. It will literally blister your finger. This right now is super hot. Lots of friction. If you hand tighten it, you'll be fine. So I'm going to tighten that until I see this gap right here start to, uh, this gap that goes across, start to compress. Then I know it's getting a good grip on that bar. And I will do that at every corner. And we'll have our upgraded Y bar ends. Only difference is, on the other ones, it's even simpler. You don't need the one inch, you just need the shorter half inch to go straight through there on all the other ones. So that is the new Y bar end.